think we've settled on our poll question. Seaton, would you give the exact wording to our audience? Firing defensive coordinator Steve Wilkes was dot, 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 the right move for the 49ers or soft. <laughs> I'm open to a second suggestion on soft. Maybe that's okay. That might be a little more editorializing okay. on my part. But. Yes, yes, Paulie. The 49ers had their season wrap-up you know, press availability yesterday. I would love to know if the 49ers happen to stop Patrick Mahomes on that fourth and one, were they firing Steve Wilkes today? Because that would be, mean his stint there had one different play. And w- I would assume no, right? If he had won the Super Bowl, Correct. does he keep his job? Yeah. Is it that tenuous? It was that one play. <laughs> That Mahomes throws the touchdown pass. Now, does he know after the game he's going to get fired? Um, but also, I, th- you know, their defense wasn't as good this year as it was in previous seasons. But I think they were um, they were vulnerable to the run. I think in the playoffs, uh, all of their games, they gave up over 100 yards rushing. I don't know if that's reason enough for uh, them to part ways with Steve Wilkes. I was told that there could have been a personality clash between the defensive coordinator and head coach Kyle Shanahan. But I don't know if it's a case of, well, somebody's got to get the blame here. We're going to blame our defensive coordinator. And Steve had been there one year. He's had two opportunities to be a head coach. One was an interim. Then he got one year with Arizona. And I don't know if he's going to get another opportunity. It just felt like Kansas City's defensive coordinator was getting a whole lot of publicity. And San Francisco's defensive coordinator was getting zero publicity here leading up to the Super Bowl. And obviously, Steve Spagnuolo did a wonderful job. But I would think if I hold Patrick Mahomes to one touchdown in regulation, and it wasn't Steve Wilkes' decision to take the ball and then let Patrick Mahomes have four downs to try to score a touchdown. But uh, Steve Wilkes is out after one year, and... You know, this happened with the Eagles, uh, but Jonathan Gannon, he he did not have a good performance against Patrick Mahomes uh, in the previous Super Bowl. He got fired, right? And then he got the job in Arizona. You got see. I mean, I guess to be fair, if the Chiefs don't get that field goal in the first half, 49ers win the game. You probably don't even go to overtime then, right? Yeah. So yeah. I guess... If the whole part of the criticism is you should have kept Patrick Mahomes and the Chief to less points in the first half, yeah, uh, I guess maybe that makes sense. And Gannon, maybe he didn't get fired. He just took the job in Philadelphia. He, he took the job in Arizona after they It's always a good sign. Yeah. Um, let's see. This is uh, <laughs> Kyle Shanahan yesterday. It just ended up uh, being not the right fit with him and uh, Steve Wilkes. We have reached out to Steve Wilkes, see if he wants to join us uh, on the program. Probably wants to lay low and not say anything here. I just can't imagine you have that meeting. You know, you, you're saying goodbye. Uh, last time the media can talk to you. And then Steve, Steve, come here. Oh, yeah. Uh, wait, what's up? I uh, just want to talk to you. Oh, okay. And then how long does it take before you say, you know what? We're going in a different direction. Oh, like, like, are you going south for the the summer? No, 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 no. The, the the team is going in a different direction. What do you mean? Hold up. So you're firing me? Yeah. <laughs> I was the problem. Wait. I thought the offense was a. So problem. Well, we only went, we went twelve and five. We we're still a one seed, but I'm the one that screwed up this season. Yeah. That, that was my call. Well, Steve, somebody has to pay the price. I'm I mean, the, oh, okay, got yeah, it. Yeah. I mean, we have to do this for the media. Like, so we're we're having changes here. Somebody's got to pay. That third quarter that was me? (laughs) Okay, got it. Got it. That's where you go. Wait, when the Chiefs went three and out, three consecutive drives. Wait. And then you put my tired defense repeatedly back out there because (laughs) your genius system couldn't move the ball a little more? Okay, got it. Got it. Just not the right fit. Yes, Marvin. You're right. I was the problem. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes, Marvin. I can't wait until there's NFL films on, you know, when Steve Wilkes is going, why are we – why oh, are we running the ball? You mean sound on the sidelines? Yeah, when there's NFL films, they get, they get the sound of Steve Wilkes going, what? what is Kyle doing? Yeah. I'm going to guess with a last name like Shanahan, that audio is never getting out. <laughs> 
I'm going to go ahead and say that uh, that would be buried. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I've been like, yeah. like, wait, Kyle, Kyle, come here. Come here real fast. Come here. Were you in on this? When you talked to John, when John Lynch is talking to oh. Steve Wilkes? Whoa, 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 I didn't do this. Like, if we if they had gotten blown out in the NFC Championship game, all right, I kind of. Well, you know I wonder if, if they had lost in the NFC title game. Does he does he lose his? Did he do something on Super Bowl Sunday that cost him his job? Was he going to lose his job no matter what? Because it feels like that. If they had won that game, does he still keep his job? That's what I would want to know. I'd ask John Lynch that. Yes, Paul. So I've been thinking about this a lot. This this storyline from the Super Bowl. It's been more about the Niners and the fallout around how they lost. This may go down as one of the worst Super Bowl losses in history, but it's not a blowout. You know, you think a blowout is worse. No, this has more tentacles because they were close again and they found a way to make mistakes again. And it's like it's it's a it's a different type of loss. It, it's ongoing. We're in it's Thursday and we're finding out new things by the day. But Jonathan Gannon, I think in the second half, his defense gave up like twenty four points or something. I mean, you have to check this. I'm just going off memory. So he gets a head coaching job based off what his defense did in the Super Bowl. Wilkes got fired. Gannon got the job that Wilkes used to have in Arizona. <laughs> yeah, Marvin. I think he got the job before the Super Bowl. Like, oh, already signed, already signed, yeah. already signed. No matter what happens, yep. mm-hmm. I'm going to you. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yes. It seems appreciate. if there's a big personality conflict and they just can't get along going forward, even if they would have won the Super Bowl, you can't fire him right away while you know they just won the Super Bowl. But I wonder if several weeks or a couple of months later, then all of a sudden when things quiet down, they just quietly part ways. 